That's cool. You're, are you compiling? Yeah, like I'm going, okay, this is the reason I bought this bag because blah, 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 blah. Oh, yeah, yeah. So today's episode on why I use it. Is it on IG? Instagram? No, it's just YouTube. We are using the C70 with the brand new 15 to 35 Canon USM stabilized wide angle lens R mount. What are they called? The RF? R, which one? This one? This lens. Is it an RF mount RF now? Mount. RF mount. We've got Danny D over here from San Francisco. Waka, 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 waka. Waka, waka, waka. He's been Gimbal Man today. We usually gimbal have Gimbal man. Boy, but today we have Gimbal Man. Gimbal Man. And all right. So usually he uses the C70 here with an EF mount, but his C70 has EF and RF mounts, so he can go back and forth. He has taken off the EF mount adapter and he's gone au naturel here in Paris with the brand new lens, which I got at Fireside in San Francisco. And it's been working pretty well. This thing is lightning quick on the autofocus. It nails it. The camera has face detection. Oh yeah, it's pretty. We'll do another video about the Ronin, which is pretty good. The 3 just came out, but today is all about this. This setup, the C70 neutral density is built in. Looks pretty awesome. Let's see what Danny thinks about this thing. What do you think, dude? Awesome. <laughs> what do you like about this lens? Wide angle. Wider than the EF lens. This one is 15 mm. The EF is 16 mm. A lot prettier. Cool. What do you think about the autofocus? Fast, lightning fast speed. Right on. Buy it. Buy it. There you go. Put it in a cart. Put it in the cart. All right. That's another episode of why we use this stuff. Because it uh, looks kind of like cool. It. It's not cheap, but it works. And the best part about it is that, well, not to sound like a total dick, but you don't need an AC anymore or a focus puller. This thing is lightning quick. It nails it. You also do the touch screen on the people's face, and it goes to it. So the, uh, the face detection will figure out how many faces are in the shot, and it'll tell you. And then you can just use your finger on the screen right over here. You just press it wherever there's a face. We're doing a down uh, firmware update, so we can't turn it on right now. I mean, we could, but oh well. Just believe me. So yeah, it works really well. So, like Danny said, buy it.